It is still top five, but Austin keeps falling on an influential list of the best places to live in the country. As recently as two years ago, Austin was number one. KXAN morning anchor Tom Miller talked with Austin Business Journal reporter Katherine Hardison about why Austin keeps falling. So why does Austin keep falling down on this list? Well, it all comes back to Austin's affordability crisis. Um, you know, we've seen it. People are just pouring into the metro. Austin has actually been the fastest growing large U.S. city for the last decade. So when you take that and you couple it with issues that we're facing, like a slim housing stock, rising house prices, um, and the fact that the median household income isn't rising at the same pace, it can definitely weigh down a city's affordability, which can lower us on a list like this. And we know Austin right now ranked number five in the nation, but how does it stack up compared to other Texas cities? We far outranked any other Texas city. Um, you know, we were actually the only Texas city in the top 30 out of the 150 metros that were ranked. Um, so Austin is far outranking any other Texas metro. And this list, it's from the U.S. News and World Report. How influential is it actually? Are people making their decision on where to live based off of how these cities stack up? It definitely is a factor that people can consider. I'd say that now more than ever, the idea of where you live um, is really important. We've really learned from COVID that it's all about uh, making your employees happy, uh, being flexible, and living in a place that you like to be in. All right. Catherine Hardison with the Austin Business Journal. Thank you, Catherine. Thank you.